Its autonomous systems offer several different operational modes, including teleoperation, follow me mode with obstacle avoidance, waypoint navigation, and goal-based mission planning. The vehicle is able to exhibit dynamic behaviors like real-time user control, autonomous pathfinding, and obstacle avoidance as mentioned earlier. Built on a high-mobility chassis with a SuperCat driveline, the vehicle shares commonality with the HMT family of vehicles. It is powered by a Cummins ISB 6-cylinder 6.7-liter diesel engine and an Allison 3000 automatic transmission, which gives it excellent mobility across various terrains. The design of the Atlas includes an 8-wheel drive system, central tire inflation, run-flat inserts, all-axle steering, and crab walk capability, letting it navigate gap crossing, vertical steps, slopes, and tight turns. Despite the fact that the vehicle is unmanned, this doesn't mean that it isn't protected. The vehicle's survivability features include tailored protection options to reduce mass while safeguarding critical subsystems like its autonomy technology and ammunition storage. The Atlas can carry several tones of payload within its protected hull, including ammunition, fuel, rations, water, and mission-critical equipment to support companion crewed platforms. All of these features have been built to help soldiers outpace, outmaneuver, and outthink conventional and unconventional threats. The Atlas has been built on more than 30 years of complex autonomous projects. For example, another role outlined for the Atlas CCV is reconnaissance, which the baseline vehicle will be able to carry out thanks to its complex sensor suite mentioned earlier that includes a multispectral automatic target detection, tracking, and classification system. Using this, the Atlas CCV could scout ahead of crewed fighting vehicles, venturing first into more dangerous areas to find targets that it could then engage itself or provide coordinates for crewed platforms to attack. This sums up exactly why the Atlas has been designed as it would be expected to take on more dangerous missions on behalf of crewed ground forces. This also includes flank security, target identification and engagement, combat reconnaissance, and direct fire. For these sorts of missions, the vehicle's combination of firepower, compact size, and high mobility are massive sailing points. The Atlas CCV's mobility is claimed to be sufficient for it to work as a combat wingman for crewed tracked vehicles as well as wheeled ones.